Good morning, everybody. Thanks for joining me while I ride my bike again. It's, um, I'm in the second round of the Mary's Mini. Uh, day number eight, actually. Wow, this has gone by fast. I can't wait to weigh myself on Thursday. I think I've probably dropped another five pounds. I kind of feel about five pounds, but we'll see. It's, um, it's pretty neat. <clears throat> I, um, I've been reading online and I've been noticing in some of the groups that I belong to that um, there are some members who are a little bit dismayed uh, because of their progress. A lot of people do marry as many, I think, to lose weight. Um, and that's one of the reasons why I am as well. Is working in conjunction with the uh, weight loss challenges in uh, in one of my groups, and um, and I some of the things that I've been reading are where uh, people are a little bit dismayed. They're not making the progress that they used to. Um, they're not um, getting um, you know the weight loss is not happening as fast as it was. And that's just something that I want to address this morning. Uh, basically, it is not going to be the way that it was. When a person first embarks on a whole food plant-based diet uh, lifestyle, um, you're gonna lose weight. You're gonna lose a chunk of it. Probably about 20, 30, maybe even 40 pounds. Um, at the beginning, your body is releasing a whole lot of junk. <laughs> and uh, with that comes some fat. And because you're not putting in a bunch of saturated fat, so that's that cause and effect. It's gonna happen. And it's gonna be a rapid drop. Some of you, that's all the weight you have to lose. Like when my son did this, that's pretty much all he needed to lose. But he got his good drop. I, I lost a lot at the beginning. Uh, about 20 of it I've been playing back and forth games with but overall I've, I've lost a lot I'm not near 300 pounds anymore that's for sure you know but then I get frustrated sometimes because I can't get past where I am and so that's one of the reasons why I'm doing a series of Mary's minis um, I like the simplicity of this uh, it keeps me focused and um, and it stops me from digressing which is uh, which is kind of important to me. Excuse me. Um, and so what I want to say to those people who are getting a little frustrated with this, uh, with the stall in what they might call their progress, let me mention something. I have a, um, there's a member in one of my groups. And one time she talked about how when she first started running, she, or her, her, um, uh, her times where she was so successful was when she could run from mailbox to mailbox. That was what she saw as successful. And then when she was telling us about this, she was already running, you know, um, 5Ks and um, uh, even longer distances you know she's probably run thousands and thousands of miles now and has made a lot of progress in other direct in other situations as well and so <clears throat> when she said when she she looked back on it she realized you never really understand how much progress you have made until you take a minute and you think about where you've come from just think about it you know I can complain Every time I get sick, get on steroids, gain a lot of weight, and then I feel like, oh, I'm starting all over again. Charm, no, you're not starting all over again. <laughs> I am not starting all over again. Man, when I was pushing 300 pounds, I was sick. I was sick. I was one of those teachers who always had an apparatus to walk with. Either walk with a cane, or I had a crutch, or I was in a wheelchair. I've done that several times, several stunts, uh, stints of using a, uh, having to use a wheelchair at school. 
I was that teacher, something was always wrong with me. As far as skeletal issues are concerned, I had my share. Um, my uh, blood pressure was high. Uh, cholesterol was high. My triglycerides were high. And, um, and I was diagnosed with prediabetes. I'm like, no, I don't want that. You know, A1C, I think of 6.3 or 6.4, it was knocking on the door of 6.5, right? No, I did not have to start all over when I got sick last time and gained, I think that time was like about 10 or 11 pounds, you know, and <clears throat> I wasn't starting over. My weight is only part of this thing. You know, there are two, two parts to this. One's health, one's weight. And so if, you'll, if, if those members and some of you will take a minute and write down all of the successes that you and your body have experienced uh, through following a whole food plant-based diet, you will be amazed and you'll be able to um, celebrate those successes. Celebrate them. And, you know, let's, let's call today's word gratitude. You know, be grateful for where you have, where you, where you are now as compared to where you were. Um, you know, the weight loss is only one component, one, one small component of this whole scheme. But the, the, the major component is, is health, is health. And so, and listen, y'all have a good day, and uh, I'll be on later.